Ready for the race? We believe the H2GP has the opportunity to combine science, hands-on practical experience and innovation in one particular program with a hope to inspire future leaders in the fields of STEM. So we support the Hydrogen Grand Prix and other STEM programs to not only share our passion, but to encourage students to study STEM at a tertiary level. We see that it really challenges students, um, makes them use things like their critical thinking ability, it makes connections between education and post-school opportunities. We can see that this program is fostering innovation in these young people. They're having to do everything with these cars. Right from the beginning, they're designing it, they're uh, learning how, how it works, and they're having to make their own decisions. You can be the world's best engineer, but you still need to be able to communicate effectively with both internal and external stakeholders, and we see real value in those attributes. And I think today is a really good example of seeing those skills in work. The kids today are communicating with each other, they're working together as a team, they're in a high pressure environment and that's exactly what you need in the workforce. If you're interested, if you're working in that space, if you're working in that sector and you want to build um, an ability to grow a workforce and have people have the skills that you need, then getting in early and inspiring school students is the best way to do it and this has been a great way to do that. This has been a fantastic event to be involved in. It's been wonderful to go out to the schools and get to know the children and see their excitement and passion for creating a sustainable energy future. It sparks an interest and a passion. I think that you know, that's the whole ambition with education um, and particularly technical education is how do we put something forward that people can engage in and, and work on. If you can, go to an event, go and have a look at it for yourself and really get to understand what it's about because it, it actually really, when you touch and feel it, you actually really start to understand what it's about rather than just being told about it.